One of our big targets within Sanitation Skanska is that we will reduce our carbon impact, um, not just within uh, our fabrications business, but also mainly across the fleet of machines that we use across the UK. This is the world's first pilot rig that has been trialled using red diesel and part replacement by hydrogen. Nulemco are the innovators for hydrogen technology. Uh, we work very closely with their engineers designing the pack. We've been gradually building up the number of conversions that we do. Um, and we have over 100 vehicles in the UK now running on the roads. We learned that there was the possibility of some uh, grant funding to assist within the overall costs of a hydrogen trial. Within about three months, we were aligned with Ulemco and we put a pack together and applied for the grant. This particular project uh, around the transition away from red diesel to, to zero carbon construction is a key part for the construction sector for industry. So it's not just construction, it's lifting, it's craneage, it's across these more challenging areas. BRE works in a collaboration, we're a research technology group, so we're doing all that to move construction to become green, you've got to take the industry with you. So we try and broker technology companies, contractors to work together and try and disseminate to the rest of the industry for the future. Using hydrogen as a fuel is a zero carbon fuel. So uh, we combust hydrogen in the engine and every part of the hydrogen that is used reduces the carbon footprint of the vehicle. So if we have say 40% hydrogen as a fuel, uh, in the mix, then that vehicle has a 40% less carbon footprint. We've trialled in Bentley, in Doncaster, where we've proved the concept. So today we're actually on site digging the first pile that's ever been done using a dual fuel system. It's, it's outperformed what, what, what we expected. We were looking for 30% hydrogen over the, the construction of a pile. We're actually getting 36 to 37 percent of hydrogen. We add gas injectors to the inlet manifold of the engine but the major part is really in the software and in the hydrogen storage that we put onto the vehicle. Our core intellectual property in our business is the software, the, the know-how behind that conversion. We've already had a workshop where we had the whole industry and they're very interested and we'd like to try and bring all the contractors supply chains and the hydrogen suppliers together to try and take this to the next stage in the real world.